Hi guys, Chris here. This video is about the documentary What the Hell. So I thought it was a great documentary and it was good to see the truth being told again about how plant-based diet is uh, great for our health and ha the negative effects of eating too much animal products. So um, yeah, in this documentary they showed how eating too much animal products increases our chances of diabetes, heart disease and cancer. And um, also, it was good when, uh, I liked it when Dr. Neil Bernard, he was asked about uh, the effects of carbs on diabetes, eating too much carbs and sugar on diabetes. And he, um, he dismissed this myth and he, he talked about how Dr. Kempner improved people's diabetes using a diet of white rice, fruit juice and table sugar. And their diabetes, the patients, their diabetes improved. And he was talking about how fat is actually what makes causes diabetes, eating too much fat. Eat more fat, you're more likely to get diabetes. Eat more carbs, you're less likely to get diabetes. You know, uh, fat, is the, the, fat is the one that causes problems with our insulin. And uh, carbohydrate improves our ability to use insulin. So yeah, it was good to be, it was good to see uh, the truth being told there. And also, you might be thinking, this, this takes care of some, some health uh, factors, but you might be thinking, all right, I, I'm playing rugby or I'm trying to be a bodybuilder. You might be thinking, where am I gonna get my protein? So they had David Carter, NFL player, who was, was eating loads of dairy and stuff, loads of animal products trying to bulk up for NFL. And he, he, could, he had bad uh, shoulder tendonitis, jo joint pain in the shoulder. And he could bench press 315 pounds. And when he went vegan, his joint pain went and he gradually went up to 465 pound bench press. So basically, there's the proof. Um, if you want to get fitter, stronger, healthier, faster, live longer, eat plants instead. No need to be in animal products. And also, like, it's great. Hats off to all the doctors and people involved in uh, that documentary because the truth was never going to come out from the big organizations. Like, uh, they were interviewing the diabetes guy, association guy, and they were talking, they were all having a friendly conversation. The interviewer was in a friendly conversation with him about diabetes and he was giving him the facts on it. And next thing, once the interviewer asked what foods cause diabetes, it was like uh, there was a big bomb dropped and your man was like, I can't talk about that. So it's nothing personal, it's just a, a money game. Like if you're getting paid by someone, you're not gonna, you're not gonna say what's the real cause, you'll, you'll lose your job. So also, yeah, so say the American, American Association, uh, Diet Agriculture, they put out these recommendations on what to eat. Eat more meat, dairy and eggs. People get fatter and sicker. People have to go to the hospital. Then the, the doctor doesn't tell them what's, what's causing it. He just gives them a little cure through medication. And then the doctor's being paid more money by the pharmaceuticals. The pharmaceuticals are making more money because more people need their medication. Everyone's winning in terms of money. The doctors, the pharmaceutical companies and the meat, dairy and egg industry. So. What's the cure? The cure is the biggest vote you have is the money you spend. So if you spend your money on plants, eating plants instead of animal products, your health will improve, your fitness will improve, you'll, you'll, uh, the environment will be saved. Well, it will help save the environment, save the animals, and also, you know, they just get that, those industries are just going to start doing something else to make money. They'll start. Instead of uh, cow's milk, it will be plant milk, like oat milk or rice milk. So, yeah, if you have any questions or comments, post below. Thanks for watching.